This work addresses the problem of computing the upright orientation of a 3D model. To our knowledge, this problem has not been studied before. We provide an effective method for object orientation in the case of standing man-made objects. Viewing a 3D model from multiple views or orienting it is often not intuitive to control. To better control and explore a shape, it helps if the object coordinate system is compatible with the world coordinate system. Given a model, having its upright orientation helps explore it from natural views, like, for example, this intuitive fly-through around the microscope. Upright orientations are also important for generating easily recognizable thumbnail images of objects. However, manual upright orientation is usually time-consuming, especially for non-professionals. It becomes even less practical when there is a very large database of models to be oriented. This motivated us to design an automatic upright orientation algorithm. Humans typically orient objects by recognizing them. However, when unable to see the models, they can analyze model geometry using their sense of touch and often guess the correct orientation. This analysis is in many ways similar to the geometric analysis that a computer can do. Nevertheless, humans may also sometimes fail when they are required to orient the model using its geometry alone. Symmetry is a very strong cue for shape orientation since typically the reflective symmetry plane is vertical. However, it merely reduces the orientation problem from 2 to 1 degrees of freedom. Searching the best orientation in the 1D solution space can still be challenging. Moreover, not all models are symmetric, nor does symmetry necessarily imply their upright orientation. Principal component analysis is the most commonly used technique for automatically computing the object coordinate system. It provides six possible orientations of a given object, with the user required to select the upright orientation among them. PCA certainly does not always produce compatible alignments with the upright orientations of objects. We observed that for many types of objects, searching for the best orientation in the whole spherical solution space is unnecessary. Instead, we can reduce the problem to selecting the best orientation from a small set of orientation candidates. This reduction not only decreases the computational complexity, but also better defines the problem. In this work, we focus on standing man-made models, that is, models that are designed to stand on a flat surface like this stool. Standing models such as this one have a natural stable base perpendicular to the upright direction. The base consists of one or more faces on the convex hull of the model. By computing the convex hull and analyzing the object's static stability with respect to hull faces, we extract a set of base candidates. For example, we have seven base candidates for this stool model. Here we show more examples of extracted candidate bases for different models. To select the natural base from among the candidate bases, we introduce functionality-related geometric attributes for each candidate. To make our method generalize well, we introduce attributes that are abstracted from concrete shapes and tailored for orientation discrimination only. We use four categories of properties, stability, symmetry, parallelism, and visibility. Generally, we prefer bases that are more stable, bases perpendicular to symmetry planes, we prefer bases that have larger areas of model surface parallel to them, and lastly, bases which lead to a bigger part of the model being visible. Like functional considerations, our attributes can be conflicting. We therefore use a supervised learning approach to design an assessment function combining all of the attributes to determine the most probable natural base. We constructed a training set of models, for each of which the candidate bases are labeled as natural or not. We combine random forest and support vector machine classifiers to learn the assessment function from the training set. Given a new, unoriented model, we use the learned assessment function to compute a score for each of its candidate bases and choose the candidate with the highest score as the natural base. We evaluate the effectiveness of our method using both tenfold cross-validation over the training set and a validation with an independent test set. The training set contains 345 models. Our method successfully predicts the upright orientations of the vast majority of models with prediction accuracy of over 90%. Here we show the orientation results with the failed models highlighted. We also constructed an independent test set of 819 standing models. Our method achieves 87.5% prediction accuracy orienting those. Thank you.